Okay, so let me just explain how I want you to save your files. Um, here's my my uh, here's a project, the figures project from the um, from the uh, from the Java book, and I'm doing this on a Mac, but you can figure out the same thing if you're on a PC. You know, here's my classes folder, and inside of there I have a folder called IOOP, and inside of there I have two. One's called my stuff, and one's called projects. And then inside the projects, I've got all the projects from the book up till chapter 10. And, and this figures one happens to be inside of the chapter one projects. And you'll notice that these BlueJ projects are actually folders themselves that have all sorts of, of, uh, of files in them. So let me hide that anyway. We don't need to look at that right now. So if we look at my BlueJ figures um, uh, project, um, and let's pretend that I've just finished example uh, exercise 1-17. I don't think it would look like this if you're done 1-17, but who knows. But let's pretend that I just finished exercise 1-17. And I have been told I need to save a copy of this on my flash drive uh, called EX or EX1 underscore 17. Right? So what I'm going to do is in the project menu, I'm going to say save as. And then actually for me, I want to put this inside of my IOOP folder inside of my stuff. Um, and unfortunately for some bizarro reason, uh, um, Blue Jay copies the name up here. But now I just need to give it the name of, a, uh, of whatever folder I want to call this. So I said call it ex1 underscore 17. So I'll say save. And now this project is called ex1 17. And if you look in here under my stuff, you'll see that now I have a folder called EX117. So now I have the EX117 project, and what I can do is I can copy this folder off of my computer and onto my flash drive before I turn it in. Okay, hope that helps.